Welcome back. Welcome back, welcome back. Episode 17 now, because I can count. And that's totally correct. Like you. Hi, by the way, welcome back to my basement. Um, <laughs> we're uh, in an endless cycle of getting our asses beat by plants and UFOs. Well, you know, what else do you do on a Sunday? Well, <laughs> I mean, usually you make your balls for nothing. Anyway, that's not what we're here for. <laughs> you with balls. We're here to solve the problem of having so many items that you need in the game that you can't actually get enough items to heal. And this is the only game that I've ever played. More importantly, you, we have officially found spell. this young gentleman's soon-to-be girlfriend in real life here. That is her over there in the bonnet, Jermessa. Ger this lady? Yes, that is for you, my friend. You are no longer single, that is for you. I... Not Ness, that is yours. Okay. I, I worry about you being so alone. I don't. I think her AI is more than enough to satiate your intelligence. That's offense taken. <laughs> oh, I, I'm just messing with you. But seriously, well, I think her hat would lo look good with your head. Crap, I didn't want that either. Uh, I'm also really calling you babe a lot today. Because you, you deserve see, it. You see how much stuff I have to brush off? <laughs> the same isn't happening. Just... Well, why, why are you so caught up in sanity? <laughs> Boo! Because I'm so alone all the time. That's true, but now you're not, because you have Jernessa. No, because you're here. <laughs> That's not what I wanted to hear at all. That's right, babe. Uh, <laughs> all right. Oh, uh, the things we do for love. <laughs> oh, good grief! I'm smiling so much it's hurting. <laughs> you're just gonna buy a car. <laughs> He just drove away like it was nothing. I, I I just stopped being shocked by that at this point. You're just used to big yellow cars hitting you. <laughs> or small buses. Pretty much. Um, hey, your egg hatched. I don't have an egg. Yes, you do. I have no chickens, dude. Sometimes there's just birds in the world. It doesn't always mean that you have to sell a chicken, you know. <laughs> That's the chicken alarm. Time to go to the store. I simply must sell my poultry immediately. To be fair, you don't really need to go to the mart. You have that weird magic sign that just makes people want to buy chickens from you. Yeah, but like, I can, I only have room. I can't throw anything away. I only have enough room at this point. So go back to see your sister. She holds on to crap for you. Alright. Maybe because we're... Just like do it. So, I'm gonna let you in on a secret. I believe you get her phone number, and you can like have people drive you items. That's what I heard. Oh, I don't think you researched it. I think you just felt it in your heart. You're not allowed to do research. I don't know. There's there's no real rules. I I just like to be stupid. <laughs> Oh, what is this? Oh, I don't know! This is where I came from. Okay. Is it? Yeah. There's woods? Oh, I guess, kinda. Just so they don't have to load both towns at the same time. Pretty much. Hey, we're back! Look at that! Now I forgot about this song. Um, okay, I'm here, buddy. We should learn to play this song. Of course not to play mushrooms. What kind of guitar do you have up there, anyway? I have a very, very old... Oh, okay, that's what I have too. That has intonation problems. Okay, do you just need new wire, like strings, or? Well, I might need to adjust the truss rod. Of course, the truss rod. No, the truss rod, T-R-U-S-S. The truss rod, yes. All right, so you are misheard me on purpose, that's fine. Um, well, now I am. Well, like, there's, there's something wrong with it where, like, you can get the open string to be in tune, but like the uh, the other notes don't work uh, because basically the frets don't align with where they should. Hey, you uh, killed that thing. Of the string. And so, like, Does that mean you, you need can a new guitar? You adjust how long the string is on the saddle, 
Uh, and if that doesn't work, then you then like the strings might be bowed too much on the neck, and so that's when you use the, the truss rod, which I don't have to string to do that. And uh, <coughs> I don't want to because I'd probably have to do five strings. Speaking of love, time for a new guitar. Do you want mine? Well, you're just gonna have the same exact problem. Because the one that I have is Greg's, hilarious. Well, we have the same exact guitar. I don't but know if that's true. It is. But I have never played it. <laughs> I've played it. And it has like two strings on it, right? Yeah, well the point being you could just repl like, replace the strings. Uh I take it that was just like a weird thing. But I don't know. I, I suppose, you know, you play it and stuff. I, I clearly don't. Yeah, no, it's not there. Uh, feeling we're almost there. I mean, I wouldn't mind just storing it here indefinitely for you. Oh, the guitar? Yeah. <laughs> you I, know. I should really just get a guitar that I actually like. Well, I think... So, you don't like my guitar? I see how it is. Well, if it's anything like the ones I have, it's, it's gonna be a problem. Maybe I don't trust Rod you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> you son of a gun. I don't want to look at the meter right now. I don't think this is your house. <laughs> <laughs> really? Nope. <laughs> well, that's embarrassing. Oh, right, this is another guy's house. I don't... Yeah, that was like Cheeto or whatever. Yeah. Or like Norbit or something else, I don't know. That's funny. Um, I just wanted some guy's house. I mean, it's not a classic RPG. What do you... I live here, don't I? I like his house. It's it's quaint. It's cute. Yup. <laughs> yup. <laughs> Did we even know you had a sister? Uh, <clears throat> I think so. I don't I don't remember, but I truly this don't looks remember. Like it was here. Hello, stranger. Good luck on your adventure. You might get hungry. So here's a cookie. You have too much stuff. Thanks. No problem here. You won't. <laughs> <laughs> no, there is a problem here. That you can, you don't talk to her. You gotta take the cookie first, dude. This is the initial dialogue. You gotta eat something. The irony. Ugh, just do it. Told her it was okay. It was a cookie. I made it myself. I ate the rest. See, there we go. That's dumb, by the way, but okay. You I told you. Okay. I, I win. Do, am I going to need that pencil eraser anytime soon? Um. Okay, so here's the deal. Put the... the, Yeah, so do that. Yes, definitely. Definitely. Okay, Um. now do the um, bicycle. We don't... Well, no, we the want that. Stone. No, we want that. Really? Yeah, because, like... If we end up killing a boss, then we have to come back. So, um, exit mouse. <clears throat> yes. Let's really just. Yeah, not. We don't need it for now. Let's let's try to do one more thing. Uh, uh, <clears throat> I think that's all we can do. Because the other stuff's just equipped, which really is stupid that it's in the same inventory. Because you're yes, wearing it. It is. Are you sure we need a pencil eraser? There's going to be more weird pencils. I'm not going to say there's not. Is this something we could research? No, just, just, you got three spaces. That's more than enough for now. Like, now we can have more healing items. That's fine. Okay, bye. We love you. Good, good job being your sister. You're all right. <laughs> the bank. Speaking of the bank. Way to dehumanize your sister, you dog. I don't think your actual sister would appreciate you talking about your virtual sister in this regard. She absolutely does. I have no idea what this is. Yeah, I have no idea what your sister is like. <laughs> That's fine. I think I've literally talked to her once. Well... 
Well, she was a cheerleader, and you were also a cheerleader, so I'm not sure why I'm so confused. She wasn't a cheerleader like, like really the new girl. Mm, I guess we are like a hundred now. You're you're like forty two. I'm only like twenty nine. You're aging rapidly. What is what is it like to be that old? Uh, time moves in circles. You know, same as it is otherwise. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. You work until you die. We're all circling the train. Some just a lot quicker than others. Look, Sid Anthony. <laughs> this is only fun because I'm older than you. Oh boy. It's been a while since we've had to fight these. You didn't need that. <clears throat> these guys are weak sauce now. Yeah, but I can take them all out one shot. You know, I wouldn't even know how to make creative decisions on how to sculpt these. Because, like, I don't understand their eyes. Or rather, if they have any. <laughs> they they look like, um, like push pins. You know? They're just the, the red and green. That was definitely a bad guy. Where are we? You're working your way back down. Okay. We're working your way downtown, walking fast. Right. Monsters pass, and you're two bound. I, I've done better. Did I ever tell you that the in like the first week that Sarah and I dated, I wrote a rap about a goose? Oh no! It was called Goose on the Loose. I think you have told me this actually. But she was charmed. Now because I'm obsessed with goose. She she was charmed and fell in love with me immediately. Um, <laughs> well, that. Was that, that means that she doesn't think that geese are bad, I would say. Oh no, it was about how bad geese are and how they want to whoop your ass. Oh, then never, I take it all back. She's yeah, perfect and you're perfect. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Just a bunch of crazy kids trying to make our way in this world. And our elder Anthony. <laughs> Is hamburger really the top, like, most healing item that we can get? Or is there something better? Um, first of all, when you go out, what do you get? Do you just not get hamburgers? Are you a garbage person? I, is this a hypothetical question or a real life question? A little bit of both. I, when I, oh, like when I go, oh, um. Like assuming the Backstreet Boys tour wasn't uh, making everybody so excited about their tour that they're staying home. Oh, well, I also like chicken. Um. I guess. I can get a teddy bear. Yeah, do it. Uh, I can't afford it. <laughs> There's an ATM right there, dude. But I can't afford it. Are you just here to say hi? Oh, amazing. Oh. All right. That's your ATM automatic transaction machine machine. This is going to be well worth one of our items lives. Okay. What do you mean? Just because we keep dying? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like going to the mall? Uh, not really. It's okay. It's, it's like a different thing to do. Did I ever tell you about the time that me and my cousin were at the mall and it was like 3 a.m.? Should I buy this? Yes. <clears throat> That's another item slot. Okay. Yeah, but it's a, a well-used one. But we were at the mall, and we were waiting for his girlfriend to get out of work because she worked at the the lady underpants store. You know. And... I think I know what you're talking about, and it's just funny that you're not saying it. Yeah, I'm, I'm being ridiculous for no particular reason, actually. But, um... Would you say that, um... Never mind. I'm pretty sure it was Victor's Secret, something like that. <laughs> I, was, I was trying to, um do like a VFD type dick. Um, Very fine dog. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but we, uh, there were very, very many paper airplanes thrown. <laughs> <laughs> like, I think we topped about 30 or 40. Because we waited for like an hour. She was kind of, she was alright, I guess. But, um, they were, security was involved. <laughs> 
Yeah, because of how many we had thrown. <laughs> well, you got kicked out of the lingerie store. No, no, no. We were in a, like a like a lobby, but like they they were sitting on top of the elevator. They were sitting on top of the like the sconces. It was a little out of hand. That, yeah, literally. <laughs> we were feeling breezy that day, man. <laughs> oh God. But yeah. Uh, and this is why I don't go to the mall, because people like you were there. <laughs> well, it was a crazy... Life was different when I was 18. <laughs> oh, very much so. Um, I, I'm literally, like, approaching double that now, <laughs> you know? No, no, you are not. <laughs> sure I am. I'm almost You're at early 30s. There. Sure I am. Double well, 18 is 36, you goon. Oh, no. Did you forget the math again? Oh. That can't be comfortable standing like that. I sit like that all the time. Yeah, but I, I assume you were drawn with manhood. This one looks like he wasn't, and is probably either in pain or speaking in helium. Did you describe me as drawn with manhood? I assume. Is that like a really um, like like medieval fancy way of saying like hung? <laughs> no, that was more of a reference to the two D style of the game. I. But I really like <laughs> what I said. Oh, okay, for all yeah. for all intention purposes, you can Drive be hung if you like. Manhood. That's amazing. <laughs> That's what you got to tell your wife. Saying that from now on? Uh, I'll tell that to my lady tomorrow. Not, not that we talk about that all the time or whatever. But hey, hey, hey! Let them dream. I forgot what I was gonna do. Rule thirty-four of the internet. Incredible. They're gonna make lewds anyway. <laughs> That, that should have set you, and I assume it will eventually. I didn't hear you. Oh, I said rule 34. Oh, yeah. They're, they're going to make lewds anyway, buddy. <laughs> but they don't know what we look like, so it's much funnier this way. They'll just draw a disembodied voice with its legs like that. <laughs> <laughs> I like how it bothers you. <laughs> that was me in high school. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't care. Oh, that's a handsome young man. Look at that. Oh, no! Nature. You gotta kill him before he whoops your bae's A's. Speaking of whooping A's, we've whooped that time into next episode. Alright. So... Next time we can actually get something done. I... This was the most entertaining episode ever. I don't know what embarrassing stuff I said 10 minutes ago, but we'll find out. Oh, I'm sure we will, you knucklehead. All right, bye, babe.